All right, everybody, back here with some stray. Teach plays here. We got our weapon, and I think we're heading back to the main enclave. That was the plan. So we'll follow our robot buddy. He still hasn't told us how to use the weapon, but we'll check it out. Alright, oh, he's going outside. Okay, how do I do that? Stop. L1. Wow, it's working great, but as, a, as I suspected, it can overheat. Let it cool for a bit. When it happened, I hope it will last until we reach the village. I hope so too, Doc. Let's roll. I don't know, I kind of like not having a weapon, because then you knew you had to run. Now you're not going to know when to run or when to fight. If this doesn't work, it looks like the electricity has been cut. Okay. So I'm going to have to get up there. Roll this other way, and then we'll roll the other one over. Pretty simple puzzle. So I actually earlier today uh, just beat Cyberpunk, which I really enjoyed. Um, it's nice to play some games by yourself. Not everything has to go on this channel, and um, you know, I quite enjoyed it. There you go, that should have helped him. Oh no! So it does overheat the bot, which is great. Oh no! Uh. Oh! Yeah, that charge doesn't last very long. Dude, that was close. Let's go back home. Yes, please, Doc. I like how he's like trying to move all sneakily, but he's just knocking everything everywhere. Watch her back. Uh -oh, seems to be going on. Keep moving. Huh. So, like, if they're father and son. Does that mean the father, like, built him? Or did they have robot coitus? How does that work? Did he adopt him as a little robot? I don't know. Thanks for saving Doc, little friend. It's great to see Seamus is no longer alive. Now we know we can fight back against the Zerks. Omo has been waiting for you by the sewers. Alright. Doc and Seamus look happy. I think we did a good thing. 
course we did. Let's go to the sewers. Oh, let's give him the last sheet music. Untitled. Exactly 44 notes. Let's hear it. Well, that's not very good, is it? Oh, one of them was really good. Momo is waiting for you on his boat. You can join him, but have you done everything you wanted to? I'll close the door behind you, don't want any Zerks coming through. Yeah, I think so. Let's go. Okay. Oh, nice boat. I believe you found Doc and got for the pleasure with this. Now we can go find the Baltazar. Let's go. I hope I don't have to like shoot things while we're on the boat. I would hate that. This is cool. Technical networks. CD technical networks. Oh look, there's some watching us up there. And over there. Yeah, I can activate the light if I have to. Which I don't really like. Oh. I'm not sure what the next game I'm gonna stream over. I was thinking maybe Disco Elysium. Um, but I don't know if I'll have time for that. We'll see. Madden comes out, uh, in a day or so for yearly access. So I'll be playing that. I won't be streaming it, though. That's kind of my play myself game. Um, and then I don't know what I'm going to play. I can't tell if he's talking. Alright, are we gonna have to do something here? Is there any way to open the gate? Can you take a look at the other side? Sure, buddy. Send the cat all by itself to open the gate for you. So, the game says it's only about four hours, so, uh-oh. Okay, that doesn't do anything. So I don't know how much longer we'll have. Play about an hour tonight, and we'll see. And that'll be almost four hours. Oh, I knew it. Yeah, we might as well get them all out. Come on now. Couple more. How am I not getting this guy? And last one. Easy. Kind of reminds me of the uh, the Last of Us when you have to push Ellie on the board. I didn't like that mission. Last of Us was all right. I played a little bit of Last of Us Part Two, but found some of the story choices to be very disappointing. But I don't want to spoil anything, so I hope there aren't any alligators. It is water. So if you can't see if you can't see the bottom of anything, you shouldn't swim in it. Especially when there's alligators around. Maybe 
some kind of like Kraken monster. Oh, I bet you can go over there. It's turning. Let's see. See, a game like this doesn't work if the ambience and the music and stuff just isn't isn't perfect. And I think I think they did a really good job on this one. You break now, buddy. All oh, this old machine is broken now. I think we can only open it manually. Okay. I'm gonna pull on these chains. It's not very strong, is he? Quick, jump below the door and won't hold for long. Okay. I can't go on with you, but I won't stop looking for a way. If you find Zabaltazar in Clementine, tell him I was brave. Of course I will, Momo. Okay. I don't like this at all. How do we know if they're gonna pop or not? Is it a proximity thing? Or is it a set? Like, did they set it to maximize uh, tension? Can I sneak by these? See, they're vibrating. You know what? They're doing a good job of at building tension here. There's no way I could fight all of them. So we have another big gate. So anything we can jump up on? I don't like having all these enemies at my back, you know. Interesting. Must be missing something. Oh no, there's a switch right there. This isn't good. We're gonna run. Oh, 
Oh, what are those? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh! Like, for things that shouldn't be able to jump that far, they sure can jump far. But then they can't jump down here? Like, that seems... Like, I'm happy, but... Seems odd. Those are those big eyeballs we saw. I wonder if it's one big organism, like a hive mind. I don't know. Oh, oh, we're glitched. No way. Okay. Oh. Hey, we found our first glitch, guys. I <laughs> know, yeah. Um. Try one more time. I hope everyone's seeing this. Um, okay, we're gonna have to load from last checkpoint. Which was a minute ago, unfortunately, but... There we go. First glitch of the... First glitch of the run. Now, if I was a playtester, I'd try and redo that glitch. I don't really care. Go this way. Okay, nothing there, I guess. I'm gonna have to jump across here. Right, open the door, computer friend. B12 or whatever. It would not open. Okay. Do I have to do both sides, maybe? Probably. Okay, the eyes don't care if, uh... Oh! That's creepy. I'm worried I'm gonna trap myself here. But I think I have to do the other side. Oh, oh that was a bad jump. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. There we go. Suckers. And we'll open this door. They don't like water. They evolved to eat metal, but they don't like water. Which is interesting. There's actually quite a few games I have in my backlog. Like, I have Control. Disco Elysium. I don't know. Look at this. That's gross. It's like some cosmic horror crap. Oh no! Oh no, B12! 
Okay, so this is a pure run. I don't think I can run faster. Again. Oh. Fine, 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 fine. Let's see where they're gonna drop. Oh. <laughs> These runs are uh, butt puckering for sure. But at least that door is closing. Right in time. You okay, B12? B12? Oh, there we go. It was dark, I was low, and I felt like I was back in the network. You saved me, thank you, friend. You're welcome, B12. Trying to that much power was rough on my computer. He's completely destroyed now, we have to be careful. Oh, awesome. The weapon we get for what? 20 minutes of the game? Beautiful. Let's keep going. We've been playing. We've already. Excuse me, we've been playing about 20 minutes. Looks like people have done something up here. Oh, hey, a robot. Hey, buddy. A traveler from the sewers. We haven't seen you in ages. Are you the one who contacted us earlier, the little outsider? The Baltazar, the outsider, has been expecting you. He's meditating at the top of our village. All right. Ant village. See, and then another really cool environment. It's a machine, the scientist I assisted used one of them. Oh. Huh. He was sick, this was the last hope he walked into the machine. When I wasn't with him, he was alone. What was he doing? He uploaded himself into the computer and then everything was done. At the upload, something went wrong. He was stuck for hundreds of years until a little cat appeared. Oh, okay. So they're transferring your consciousness to, uh... I was the scientist. I was human. Huh. Cool. I need a moment. Interesting. Who's this guy? I'm sorry, I... I need a moment. I don't feel like talking right now. Okay. We'll get you to the top then. Oh, what are they playing? Can we ruin it? Yes, we can! Amazing. <laughs> Go out on the tree. It's a beautiful game. Oh, that's the other game I was thinking of uh, streaming, because it's kind of silly and fun to stream. It was, um, I thought maybe the quarry, but we don't have that much, uh, many people watching. So maybe if we get a bigger audience, we'll play the quarry and we can make this easier together. Um, what else have I forgotten? I must have had parents, friends, what happened there? I wanted to open the city, but is there even anyone left to see it? Um, there's a game called Ancestors, Human or Humankind, the Ancestors of Legacy or something, and you're like monkeys trying to evolve. It's awesome. Okay, this must be the Baltazar. I'm gonna take a drink. What is this? Huh. 
Hey, don't you know not to interrupt a fellow during his transcendental meditation? Oh, it's you. You were with Momo when we received that call earlier. I'm glad to meet you at all. Uh, you know, Momo and Doc, so you're already familiar with us outsiders. I miss them. Their memory brings you to Momo stayed in the sums. I heard you helped find Doc in front of him. She's in Midtown now if you still want to see the outside. She's the only one, she's the one who can be here. Apparently she had some kind of plan to leave the city. I wrote her address on the back of this picture. Clementine's picture. To reach Midtown and climb up our little village, it should be easy for a dexterous one like you. To manage to reach the outside, you'll be the very first. I wish you good luck with that one. I believe in you. Sorry for shutting down earlier. Probably the last in the world. Now what looks like it. So much has come back to me. How much have I forgotten? Maybe if we find Clementine, we can restore my memories and get, back, get you back home at the same time. We can go back down and find out more from the companions. Or hang out. Let's keep going to Midtown. It's interesting that this has that motif because uh, sorry, I just the music took me back there for a second. Fantastic, absolutely fantastic. Um, the motif of like putting your consciousness into a robot is actually quite present in cyberpunk as well. So I was thinking about that a lot today, like. If you store your consciousness in a robot and then you die, that's not you because you you've just created essentially a clone, right? Would that be the case? Like like you like it's essentially like you would create two different paths and the one path of you dying is you then you die, right? So it ends it. And then the other path would be a completely new person, but with your personality and memories. Okay, so I can still turn on the light, but don't have uh, the weapon. No, it's pretty amazing where we've come for, come to. Look, this is a subway station. I had completely forgotten this kind of transportation exists. You can ride through anywhere in the city people used to take to go to work. I used to take it too. Every morning after saying goodbye to my family at home. I remember I was doing this for them, but they're gone now. It was so long ago. They wanted to see the outside. Does that even matter anymore? What happened to them? What happened to everyone? Um. Anyway, we're near midtime. Let's find this point. Out. We have a picture of her. We can show it to someone. Some of the companions around here. Maybe they'll put us in there. Okay. Like. I'm, I'm going to get a little bit, uh sad here but like some of my earliest memories are playing playing games with, or watching my mom play video games like the Final Fantasy and the original Nintendo and stuff like that and I see things like this and like it makes me uh, think that like how cool it would have been for her to be able to have seen this um, would she still be playing video games? Do you, do I get my love of video games from her? I think she's the one that introduced them to me. Um, I'm pretty sure. Okay, um, let's remember this part. Books. There's so many books here. The Turing Test Legacy, The Ethics of Art and Fiction. 
I recognized some of these from the library. I remember nothing was quite like the smell of books in the corner of the page. It was a feeling almost like comfort. A book was spending time with someone. I want to talk to this person. The Duke. I'll show him the picture. Nothing. Okay. Thanks for nothing, Ladoc. Oh. Oh, hey. That guy has a drone, too. Oh, there's police up here? That's crazy. Please state your identity. Cooperator, we'll have to transfer you to jail and reboot you. What? Please leave me alone. I'm not the one you're looking for. If you're looking for Clementine, I'm sure she's hiding in the residence. What? Look at this! Midtown. This is cool. So there's people like there's a fully grown society here that has no idea what's going on underneath. At Nico Core, we work all day long to gather the waste and send it downstairs. Being downstairs, it has been a while since we've had news from them. Cool picture that one. Hey, is that an address on the back? First symbol is a street, and then there's a floor and a door. Should be pretty easy to find. Okay, so can I look at it? There we go, examine. Let's rotate it. So NO, three dots, five dots. Like deciphering another language, this is crazy. This is awesome. It's a little big. But this is really cool. If you're looking for some company to talk about poetry, I live behind the elevator. Fall on fly. Okay, so NO, three dot, no dot. Oh, is that NO? Is that the NO we were? Yeah, okay, and then three dot and then one dot. So third was the four, right? Two dot. And then five was the building. It's a neat little binary system, actually. It makes sense. Okay, go up to the third floor. And we gotta find number five. One, two, three, four, five. Of course, it's the one that's boarded up. Oh. I thought you were seen. Were a scent. Never mind. Who are you? What do you want? Wait. So is the Baltazar finally decided to send someone? I guess you're my new recruit. You're not very big. How did you even manage the sewers? I guess you must be pretty resourceful. I've been looking for a way to the outside ever since I left, left the airport. The sentinels are always watching. Now that you're here, you can help me. Follow me. Will do, Clementine. Will do. I've been working on a plan to use this old subway for a while. I even have the keys to start it. 
All we need is an atomic battery to power it. I know Neko Corporation has one secured inside their factory. I have a contact who can help us infiltrate them. I don't know his name. He's the robot with the bomber jacket and the gold chain. Take this message to him. Okay. Someone small and smooth should have no trouble sticking inside the One last thing. Don't hesitate to ask God for help. The city is full of information. Just stay clear of the sentinels. Okay, so we have to find a guy with a bomber jacket and a gold chain. Where did I come in from? Over here? Nice quick little way down to set tape. Hey, those tapes are ours, don't you know not to steal? I could give you one, but you'll have to do something for me. You get them off our backs. No. I don't care about you. Okay, bomber jacket gold kit train. Talk to these people. Guy wearing bomber jacket gold chain. Yeah, I think I saw that earlier today. He was in the club. Right okay, the club. Ooh, Sentinel. Get out of here. That's not a club. Doesn't look like a club. Where the club at? Residency Shop Street, Necrocorp. Hotel. That's where I came through. <laughs> so I wonder if these are all all of their consciousnesses consciousnesses have transferred into uh it's this way. Doesn't look like it's that way. Doesn't look like it's that way, so let's head this way. Is this a club? What's this? Oh. Then we can enter the shop while it's being restocked. Okay. So that's a shop. Ooh, that looks like a sign for a club. There we go. There's a bouncer, nice. Clubs closed, get lost. Alright, let's find a way inside. There's our way inside, clearly. How do we get up there? Oh, this music. It's so good. And it's not even like my kind of music, but it just, it fits the game so well. Oh, maybe I can't get in that way. Well, that's disappointing. Maybe a reason that this is... Let's see if anyone's home. I don't know what the downstairs neighbors are up to, I keep hearing plus saw and hammer like. So that didn't work. Hmm. Oh, maybe I can show them the thing. Rob, I don't take pride in the value of my work. What is that anyway? Hmm. Does that mean? Oh! That's a bomber jacket. 
the quilted jacket. Oh, that was cool. I can't get into the bar though. Oh. Hmm. This is one I'm not too sure on. I would love some help. We still in a bar. It was the closest place around here. So I took a screwdriver to the knee and that was closed now. Clearly a Skyrim reference. Good job. Good job. Talking to this guy. Why has he got a dunce cap on? Is in the city below? I had a friend there. PC. I haven't seen him in ages. Okay, that doesn't help. Huh. This is getting frustrating. I don't know what to do. So just stay away from Sentinel. It's over here. This is the main square. Let's talk to this guy. Merchant Crick sold me a faulty battery the other day. Now he just pretends not to hear me every time I confront him. It wasn't for the Sentinel, he's going to end up scared. Can I do something with the Sentinels, maybe? See, this is heading back to where I came from, to my left. I don't like that green glow, it's kind of sickly. Okay, what am I missing, everybody? Talk to this person, they look shady. I'm busy, what do you want? Where did you get that? Oh, you're without my contact. Oh! Hey, found him. Let me brief you about the atomic battery. Battery is powering the Neko Corp factory right there, but this whole area is restricted and heavily guarded. They check every person who enters and turn away anyone who is not a worker. Okay. Uh, give me a worker's jacket and a worker helmet while I stay here and check for a good token by man. Okay, so this other guy over here. Got a worker jacket? This guy has a worker hat. Like my outfit is important for security. Got it from the clothes shop and the hat shop, but they don't I doubt they are your size anyway. Okay, let's check out the stock shop then. Here's a clothes shop. Talk to this guy. One of those young punks listening to a lot of music all day. Don't touch anything, don't make any noise, don't have to. Fine, I'm just gonna steal stuff. This thing. Oh. Okay, I have to distract him somehow. Can I knock stuff over and distract him? Go to the back room and distract him? I don't feel a little bit like a peeping tom there. Oh, we gotta... Is it really we're gonna have to go get loud music and then... Come back here to... Of course it is. Is this the hat shop? Well, that's the Sentinel area. What's this? Food place, Kate. Okay. Yeah, this cat hasn't eaten in a while. Okay, let's deal with these security cameras. So where are these security cameras? There's one. So how do I get rid of them? No, nope, it's over here.
<laughs> Get the other one. Oh, come on. Let me jump across. Oh, that's stupid. Why wouldn't it let me... Okay, let's head back up. Go around. Okay, that's two. Where's the third one? I don't even hear it. Interesting. You can kind of hear the whirring. There's a third one. Yeah. Okay. But where is the third one? I've got one. The one at the entrance or something? No. Okay, let's listen for the whirring. Look at him run. Maybe up on the third floor? Okay, follow this cord then. Oh, maybe not. The cord did, did go by one of them, but... Oh, there it is. Up to here. Can we get up there? No. Okay, I'm gonna go up here. Over here. There we go. And we can run downstairs after doing copious amounts of vandalism to the Midtown Sentinel Force. Well done, I didn't think you could do it. Here, take your prize, you and Jeez, I'm lucky I randomly tried to grab that thing. Cause, uh, I would have had no idea what to do. Is the hat store? Yep, okay. So we go in here, we put that loud music on. And then we steal the jacket. Oh, he's gonna hate that. <laughs> I hate that. Okay, let's get out of here. Now where's the hat store? What does that say? Why do they need so many like fans for ventilation or robots? Okay, hat store, hat store. I'm assuming this one's the hat store. Yeah. Waiting for Stuplash to get back and restart the hats and blocks. I'm not happy. He's slacking off the bar again. Bar's over here. Is the bar open now, maybe? Nope. Okay, that's a club. Is that different than the bar? Nope. Okay. Oh. Yeah, that's not a bar, that's a barber shop. I think. Why would they need a barber shop? This stupid thing, Marcia. Okay, we'll go this way. Nothing. 
find a bar. Is this a bar? What am I gonna do? We just don't want a bar, we suppose there's place around here. Was the name of the guy slacking off again? Oh, that's terrible. My memory's so bad on that. Stuplashy. Stuplachy. Okay. That seems strange. So where do we go? By the bar. But clearly this is the bar, right? Who's this guy? Oops. That's what happens, punk, when you slack off. Can you stoop watch? Nope. Okay. Audrey. Might have to look this up, everybody. I'm not sure. It's down here. Are we going down here? It's a clothing store. Okay. Something we can maybe climb up. Oh, hey. Okay, so that must be the outsider symbol, right? Because he's on there. Um, he's on their houses and stuff, right? In the other place. There's a window there. That was hidden pretty good. Hope this takes me somewhere. Nope. I don't know where I'm going, but... No! I did not want to... Maybe I did. I was tapping X way too much. Now what? Am I missing something? I don't see very many axes. Go back over here. This is where I came from, right? Yeah. Can't jump on that, so we'll jump over there. It's the only thing it's letting me jump to, but why would I want to jump to these things? Yeah, I'm missing something. Sorry, everyone. I know this isn't super riveting. Cross to there. Oh! 
That seems to be something. You know? Hmm. I near the bar or anything? Or why is this? Confusing. Must be it. Okay. Got a police badge. Okay, what does that mean? Well, I wonder if I can show it to the bouncer. That would be hilarious. Be like, you have to let me in. Because I'm robot cat cop. Go back to the bouncer and show them the badge, see if that works. Okay, nope, that doesn't do anything. Could this be a bar? Well, I'll take a food stand. Okay. So where the heck is the bar? Hmm. Dry air in a bowl of hot oil. Oh, oh. interesting to see Romans. Mimicking human work in the area. Here they seem to sell burgers and sweet things. Remember, fate, my favorite place to go when I was young. It was a small, lovely, and the server's name was. I don't remember. It started with an M, I think. Yeah, we're definitely not going to 100% this game. We definitely have missed the majority of the collectibles. That's okay. This is a hotel. Does the hotel have a bar? This looks like a bar. Oh! Even this guy is. I bet you he's the guy we're looking for. Let's wake him up by doing some cat stuff. <laughs> Come on. Oh, he's not very happy. Get back to work, slacker. Oh, sweet. And then I bet you they deliver me inside. That's kind of clever.
I like that they're getting mad at each other. He's like, oh, I'm sorry. My bad. Look at how beat up he is too and rusted. Is that because he's like an alcoholic? Or... Can robots be alcoholics? Oilaholic? Something? I don't know. Wait till he turns his head. Flip out. Okay. Where's the hard hat? Hard hat, hard hat. There it is. There we go. Okay, I think we have everything. Let's go find... Where was he? He's back here. Still being shady. Give me a worker jacket and worker helmet. Yep, don't worry. Of course they did. I <laughs> trust how mine turning around. The robot is modest. It's a great, a little snug around the waistline, but it'll do. Okay, hop in the box, I'll sneak you across the checkpoint. There we go. That wasn't too bad to figure out. Robots would have more security protocols. Oh, well, this is like a stealth section for sure. There we go, nice. Okay, let's watch the pattern. Okay, we can go now. Ah! Okay, got a little aggressive there. Let's retry it. We can do this. We can do this. I don't know what the box will do. Like that one, I don't think the box helps that much. So there's two there. Let's watch their pattern. He comes back around here, he goes over to here, quickly turns. Hmm. There we go. I do not like stealth games, just so you all know. Never really have. Unless they're really easy. They stress me out too much. Because you're, you're here, you can help me. I lost my keys. If I find his keys, I'll help you. Okay. This one did. Pretty basic back and forth. What's up, Goonie? Barely made it. I, uh. Stealth section all of a sudden. Good day to be a cat. I guess every day is a good day to be a cat, Goonie. Let's jump on the switch. I didn't know. I don't know how much longer I'll be playing, Goonie. Just so you know, but it's nice for you to join us. I've been trying to keep this to hour-long segments, but 
Mistake. Oh, that's good to hear, Goonie. So I'm gonna have to go by as this thing goes by. Oh, I don't like that at all. You missed it, Goonie. We had a weapon and then the weapon didn't work anymore. And, uh, yeah. But you missed quite a bit, you'll have to catch up. We're up in like, there's like this even bigger village of robots and stuff. It's kind of cool. I'm trying to steal a battery right now. Let's hit this, see what happens. Oh, jeez. Yeah, no more defense against the headcrabs. You only get it for like half an hour. And there's these giant eyes that we missed. Oh, jeez. Okay. Go over here. And I've died a couple times, so. Or once. I died once, I think. Still, this stealth stuff, I hate it. Oh, see? Get out of here with that. Oh. oh. Down goes Kitty. Maybe I'm getting tired. A death counter? Oh my gosh, I have to start from the beginning here? Oh, okay. Well, now I'm upset. This is the very beginning of the factory. Yeah. That's really annoying. That's just bad checkpoint systems. Okay, so we go here, 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 here. Race around here, jump in here. <laughs> Might have messed that up. And I gotta jump. Behind this one, yeah, that's right. Go through there. And this one, what was it? This one was easy. Down to here. go. This one was just like go with the shadow. Ugh, okay. Almost back to where I died. Now there's way more stress on me. Pull this down. Is this where I died? I think this is where I died, yeah. Where's the robot? Uh, the robot's not here. Well, we clearly have to take advantage of that. Oh wait, okay, that was just the robot we had before. This that was just a way to backtrack. Okay, so we have to keep doing this with the shadows. What's this one doing? Here. Okay. Now maybe we do shadows for this one. 
Okay. Yeah, I think I broke it. Or it's like, um... I don't know if you ever played Metal Gear Solid 4, but if you're that bad at stealth, eventually they would give you a... I wonder if I can roll through with this. Or get its momentum going, and then... Hmm. Um, Metal Gear Solid, Solid 4... If you if you kept getting caught in stealth, they would give you a chicken helmet or something. They they would ask you if you want to play as a chicken helmet, and uh, and uh, it would make it easier. Well, that looks like an atomic battery, doesn't it? That's a neat little thing. Okay, so I have to make it follow me over here. So maybe the game just took pity on me. Oh, for sure it would have. Okay, so what did that do? So if I hit this, okay, I need to get the other one over here. One of these open those? Or do I need to bring this over here to jump over? I bet you that's what I need. I'm surprised you haven't played the Metal Gear games. Those are fantastic games. Very philosophical in terms of like war and things like that. There we go. With the advent of PMCs and things like that. Come to me, my pretties. Put you over here on this one. Don't know why I want you on this one, I just got a feeling. Then I'll go on the last one. Okay, sneaky. I don't think that does anything, but... One out there I can grab. Doesn't look like it. Can't flip that switch. Hmm. What if I pull this guy over here? Does that do anything? He's on a different switch. Hey Goonie, what am I doing wrong? Anything over here I can grab? No. Oh! What if I do this? Oh, I can roll this on. Oh, that was stupid. Now I have. My atomic battery. Beautiful. Uh oh. So we're getting the atomic battery so we can get the subway going. We got it. I have to do the thing, then the other thing. Thanks, Junior. Let's get out of here before the semis show up. We gotta get the battery back to semi time. Sure. So we'll get the battery back, and then I'll probably call it. Because then I think I'll play it all the way through the end, maybe. Or maybe I'll get to the next chapter, and then I'll play it. Okay. Now where was Clementine? 
Seven timers in the apartment in her ramshack. So yeah, we found this big city type thing. There's cops called sentinels. They don't seem to be very nice. Oh no. Great, now there's more of these things. I hate this. Go, oh, go, go! She was on the third floor! to see here robots go back to your normal patrol routes yes nothing to see so what is that one doing Turn this way. There you go. Oh, Clementine's okay. What? Ridiculous. Is there something down there? How else do I get up? That's all I remember there being a staircase to. Didn't mean to do that, but that's okay. Anything here? Something. I got around it, so. this one doing okay that's Clementine's right in front of us those of you that haven't didn't watch the beginning of the stream I'm in time. Where you at? Oh. What's beeping at me? Clem? Hmm. No sign of Clementine. Oh, what's that? It looks like some kind of coded message. We're going to have to play detective to figure out what happened to her. Ah! So B called in the cast. My answer lies in my stuff. And then there's four symbols. Signed Clementine. Take a look. Okay, so one's clearly like a lava lamp. Or four would be the lava lamp. Three looks like something on a table. I have no idea what one and two are. But let's look around. <laughs> Sensors can only detect harmless chemicals in the gaseous state. They can't recreate the common sensation I remember. Like me, companions can't smell, so I wonder why I do this. Oh, and we found out. So. Uh, you think she's a slight conspiracy theorist? I'm with Kate. Um, we also found out 
that B12, the little floating robot, was a human at one point. Just so you know. Oh, what an odd thing to have in an apartment. Is this the way the companions here see you? Kind of funny. Look, something's been left here. It says something, something come to. Okay. What's that? You found something. I don't see anything. Are you sure? Okay. Where's the lava lamp? There it is. No idea what this is, but it's glow is kind of mesmerizing. Sorry, I was also. I didn't even notice this message here. It reads nightclub. Oh, so she's in that nightclub I've been trying to get into all episode. So what's the last thing? I don't think it's that. No, it's not that. Let's look at the piece of paper. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, that thing? No. Oh. Do need a gramophone? No. This thing. This gem is of medium value and low purity. The glow seems to have been added or Maybe it acts as a beacon for us to find something new. Here we go, there, there's a message it says. I'm with Blazer, come to night. Lieutenant Cat. Lieutenant Cat, I should say. Let's go find her, we don't have much time. Alright. Another way to get out of here that I don't have to run past all those... Robot? But yes, I, I think your theory is right, Goonie, on her being a conspiracy theorist, considering all the lava lamps and incense and stuff like that. Definitely a hippie, at least. Oh, sweet. We got our quick way down now, too. Which is nice. Oh, jeez. We're just going to run. Suckers. <laughs> okay, let's go to the nightclub. Oh my gosh, I love that there's a lineup. That's hilarious. I don't think the bouncer is going to let us in. I think we're going to have to climb up the back again. It's not for you to go away. <sighs> yeah. Well, that's new. That person was never up there before. It's like in Night of the Roxbury when their, their, their idea for the club was that the party, like the line also danced too. Talk to this guy. Oh, let me okay. So there's a window up here before. Do you think it's open now? It is. How did you get up here? You want to party with us? Yeah, I want to party with you. Hope I get to do some kind of cool cat dance. Oh. Why is there a lineup if the club is empty? It's ridiculous. There's Clementine over here, I think. Nope. This club sucks. When I tried to go to that stupid VIP room, they kicked me out. I stole this left one just for kicks. Get me a drink, I'll give you this silly lever. I don't need it, and I don't want to be gone. Done. Let's give him a drink. I don't know why I want a lever, but I want it. I'm a cat. Oh, I was hoping there'd be a dance prompt.
Okay, we have a la lever. Lever? Lever? And we're on stage. Yeah. I'm with the DJ. DJ Matsy here, let's get the party started. First song has been requested. A very unquestionable friend, Blazer. I want to scratch the record. useful to me. Okay, so I'm gonna go do that and then time it and then maybe I get to scratch the record. Oh no, I jump up. There we go. I was so focused on scratching that record I <laughs> missed what I was supposed to be doing. I think it's hilarious. Oh yeah. Clearly supposed to be making a path here, right? What happened? Oh, he's having fun in the VIP section. See, even robots have VIP. I actually used to work sometimes on the VIP section. We didn't have it very often. Very good, um, but it was fun when we did. We had some celebrities come in. And... Oh no, Clementine! How can she not talk? That's ridiculous. Uh oh. Two birds with one stone. You're not as clever as you look, little cat. Anyway, nothing personal. Business is business. How dare you, Blazer? I will not forget this. Betrayal, even though I don't know who you are. Business is money. And I value money way more than friendship or camaraderie. They're all yours. <laughs> it's been wired to the chair, yeah. Oh, they got me. Did I do something wrong? Al Cat Raz is the is the trophy. I don't know if that pops up on your guys' screen, but that's funny. Oh gosh. Look at this. I don't have my backpack anymore either. This is a fantastic pun, Goonie. Hmm. I haven't gotten the title card for the next... Oh, there it is. And we're in a jail. So that's, uh, I think that's a good place to stop it for the night. Um, thanks for joining me, Goonie. Hope you're enjoying the content. Uh, have a good night, everybody. Class dismissed.